All right, guys, it's me, the gift, three time, Mr. Olympia, here in my hotel room here in Rio de Janeiro, getting ready to make my departure back to the United States. Yes, I know it was a very, very quick trip. I must have to say, all of you guys here in Rio de Janeiro, you guys are amazing. It's the first time I've actually been here, and uh, courtesy of Team Muscle Tech and also GT Nutrition, official distributor of Team Muscle Tech products here in Rio de Janeiro and all throughout Brazil, and my guys over at Sportica as well. Um, you guys are so first class. I really appreciate it. Um, you know, I was able to train over at a couple of different gyms. Was able to uh, chop it up with uh, a couple friends of mine, obviously. Um, but uh, you know, I just have to be real with you guys, man. I mean, it was an honor and a privilege to be able to come out and, um, you know, just represent as being the ambassador of the sport, being Mr. Olympia, but more importantly, me being able to absorb some of the culture here in Brazil, was able to go to a lot of different restaurants. Um, that was amazing. Uh, I think I ate a little too much last night over at the uh, Brazilian Steakhouse. And, you know, that's one of the cool things about being a champ is that, uh, or being a pro bodybuilder at that, is that uh, obviously people love you, but you get the opportunity to show love back, and you know, and I was able to do that. Um, you know, I was signing everything. I actually didn't sell one ounce of merchandise, which was actually pretty cool this time around because uh, uh, normally I would have like a huge stand set up, and, and this time it was a little different. I was more intimate with the fans, and I think a lot of you guys really appreciate it. Doesn't mean that you can't go pick those shirts up and hats and all this other stuff over on my website. But uh, this was a little bit different. I wanted to make sure that each and every one of you guys that were waiting hours and hours was able to actually uh, get to get to you know meet me. And I know that uh, you know my Portuguese is horrible, and I know some of you guys don't speak very good English as well. But the connection that we were trying to have, you know, to be able to share a smile, a handshake, you know, I probably flexed tons of times. I mean, a lot of guys uh, with front double bicep, this and that, blah blah blah. You know, it was just really neat to be able to have that experience. Um, you know, obviously, you know, shout out to Jim and, and Bob Lorimer and all, obviously Arnold Schwarzenegger for having the event um, and all of their supporters as well, all the judges that uh, came out, you know, from the United States and all, you know, different parts in between to, to make sure that the contest itself uh, was pretty, you know, well ran. Uh, I know it's a little different sometimes um, putting on events, uh, being a contest promoter myself, uh, especially in another country where you may not know the language. and. Um, I felt like the accommodations for all the athletes, you know, including myself, um, I wasn't staying at the host hotel, but everything was really done well, and the food was actually really good. I keep talking about the food because I'm in off season still. I don't start dieting until June 1st, but um, you know, I, I just wanted to do something a little different. I normally never do videos, um, and I just realized that the people that I've met enabled me to want to do them, and and give you guys kind of an insight as to where I'm traveling, how am I feeling, and uh, where I'm off to next. So with that said, getting ready to put some clothes on and then um, head on over to the airport. And uh, first flight's over to Houston, and then from Houston, short layover, uh, go through immigration and stuff, and then go back home to Denver, Colorado. Uh, shortly thereafter, I'll be going to Seattle, Washington. Um, my father, my biological father, passed away on March 29th and I'm having their memorial service in Seattle, Washington during that time. And then I'll be off to uh, Pittsburgh to get with all the you know, top guys in the, in the world um, to go guest pose at the NPC Pittsburgh, IVB Pittsburgh, uh, courtesy of Jim Mannion. And uh, that's all, also a great event over at the Soldiers and Sailors um, Auditorium. And uh, you know, it's really, really neat. But um, you know, after that, I, I got a little bit of downtime, just a, about a week and then I get ready to <laughs> go over to the Body Power over in the UK over in Birmingham over at the NEC and a shout out to those guys as well. I'll be over at the Team Muscle Tech booth in addition to my own booth with uh, the guys over at Body Coaches. So be sure to check out my website for all the appearance schedule uh, www.philipheath.com and oh before I let you guys go merchandise I know a lot of guys have been like, what's going on? What's going on? What's going on? We made a huge conversion. 
a huge conversion with database management systems. I, being an IT guy, really always trying to stay on top of technology and making sure that uh, your orders are getting processed faster. The only issue was that um, sometimes data got lost, and uh, I apologize for that, but we are making sure that each and every one of those people over the past two months will be able to have their stuff, in addition to hopefully get some coupon codes out there. I know a lot of you guys love that stuff, and uh, we'll be making sure that um, you'll be taken care of. Uh, what I mean by that is domestic orders, we're talking about less than a week um, arrival time with confirmations and everything. Uh, international, hopefully even uh, the same amount of lead time, but uh, maybe uh, depending on customs, uh, one to two weeks. So just bear with me, guys. I know a lot of you guys have been hitting me up on Facebook and Instagram and Twitter and, and all this other stuff. I do hear it. I do recognize it. I'm working on it, and I've hired a team to make sure that we can get this rocking and rolling. Um, Last but not least, uh, love you guys. You know, it's uh, a big year coming up for the 50th annual Mr. Olympia contest. Tickets will be on sale, uh, I think, now. So um, be sure to check that out. Um, and, and, you know, my training has been going really good, even though I've been dealing with a lot of personal stuff, you know, my dad passing, and then also my wife actually um, having another surgery. Um, post her uh, breast cancer scare from last year. Uh, she's actually cancer free and everything, but uh, just had some, uh, had an infection last year that she had to get taken care of. And, and um, so we've uh, been trying to stay tough, trying to keep the faith, and then uh, just continue to press forward. And, you know, overall, I, I just truly believe that um, uh, this year is going to be a great year for Team Heath. Um, I know a lot of guys are very excited for the Olympia. We've got a lot, a lot of athletes getting ready to gear up and, and get on it. Uh, a lot of you guys are going to be able to see the, the guest posting that I'm talking about over in Pittsburgh um, in a week. It's time, and uh, it's going to create a lot of hype. I know, um, you know, Kai's going to be there. Uh, I think Rami's going to be there. Um, uh, Wolf, uh, Branch. I, I think a lot of Dexter Jackson, a lot of these guys are uh, top athletes, top, top, top guys. And it's always good for the fans to be able to see um, – what we're looking like pre-contest, off-season, uh, I know Remy's getting ready for the New York Pro, I believe, if not that, or Chicago, I'm not sure, um, but I know he's looking like, you know, freaking beast, uh, I know Kai's always looking awesome, Branch, perfect, uh, shout out to Branch, man, we got to hang out in, in uh, Denver, Colorado, he guest posed over at the uh, Colorado School of Mines not too long ago in Golden, Colorado, got to spend some good time with him as always, always a good person, um, I know Dennis Wolf's going, you know, hungry like a wolf, you know, always trying to you know make us make a statement and he he's had a really good start of the year so you know we got a lot of lot of a lot of good guys i mean you know taking myself out of the equation meaning it's just you know uh, being as a fan of bodybuilding which i am even though i'm the champ a lot of these guys are just incredible i, I watch them all you know and i'm very proud to uh represent them in many different forms but um i feel honored to be able to be on the same stage with them and uh obviously my goal is to continue to win and to you know, work hard, bust my ass, and all that stuff. But uh, these guys are, are well, collectively, we all are what bodybuilding is. A collection of different types of physiques, different types of backgrounds, different types of mentalities. And we are trying to give you guys the perspective so then you guys can stay focused throughout any type of hardship, any type of adversity, any type of, I don't know what I'm gonna do with my life situation. Uh, I know uh, I preach three major things when it comes to these uh, thing we call bodybuilding, which is train hard, train smart, and overall have fun. And uh, if you guys notice, like I always end up smiling when I talk. I, I really enjoy the sport. And um, I'm trying to, I guess, remind us all that no one's putting a gun up to our head to make us do this. And uh, we do it because we love it. I do it because I love it. And now being three-time Miss Olympia, not only do I love it, but I love the fans and I, and I love the people that just are into the world of health and fitness. I don't care if you ever compete or not. You guys give me more motivation than you could ever imagine by all the pictures that are taken, by all the handshakes that I've been able to give, to all the hugs, to all the emails, to all the tweets, to the Facebook posts, um, even the people that don't want me to win and stuff like that. They they are fans, they are fanatics, they are the, 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 the body of bodybuilding. And, um, you know, I just really wanted to, to say all that. Um, I don't know what really came over me, but uh, you guys have to let me know on Facebook. You have to let me know on Twitter. Let me know on Instagram. Let me know on all three. Um, even write Flex Magazine and let them know that if you like these type of videos, these, these 
I'm trying to keep it under 10 minutes, but uh, if you really like them, let us know and uh, I'll do more of them, I promise. All right, so until next time, the gift, three times, hopefully four times, going for that clean sweep, hopefully the 50th Annual Mr. Olympia Contest, and we are out, peace.